Hello, and welcome to Longmont Public Media 101 class series. I'm Sergio Angelis, Executive Director for Longmont Public Media. Today, we're just gonna do a quick little uh, class slash tutorial on the GVM uh, Studio LED light kit that you can use here at LTM Studios or uh, to rent and take elsewhere. Um, so GVM is a great video maker. This is the kit that you can use here in the studio. Um, so yeah, let's, let's get to it. So first thing you'll notice when you open it up is that it will come with two stands as it does come with two lights. Um, these are kind of pretty simple to set up. You just kind of uh, expand them down here at the bottom. Um, like so. I'm just gonna do one just so you can look at it. So it does come with two since it does come with two lights. Um, and then it also does come with two uh, charging cables uh, and power adapters. This is so that um, if you don't wanna use uh, batteries, um, which I have some right next to me, to power these, these lights, you can also plug them into a power source. So those are it. And then at the bottom of the flap, uh, you have the lights. What the lights look like, um, they come with a protective covering like this, um, and this is it. So on the front, you've got uh, kind of the reflectors, and then on the back, you have the battery inserts as well as the control panel um, and the, the power here um, so that you, know, you can turn it on and stuff. So uh, yeah, let's, uh, I'll kind of show you how to do it. So um, assuming that you want to use batteries, so you'll grab uh, two of these GVM uh, batteries uh, that we also have here in the studio for you to use, and you just slide them on in like so. And then you'll notice that on the back of it, there's the, the power with both a zero, which is for off or O for off, and then a one and a two. The one is if you're using uh, the power adapters, uh, and the power adapters go in here, and if you're not, then you want to use the number two and that's for battery. So the first thing you'll want to do is uh, just kind of open these up. And again, you can configure these, you know, to wherever you want the light pointed and all that. Um, and then what you'll do is you literally turn it on. So you uh, move the power thing over to number two. And then it'll take a second to turn on and you'll see that light is coming out. Um, so there's a couple settings for you to just kind of know about uh, behind the scenes and kind of what you can change. So the first is this BRR here on the back and I'll start slowly turning it. And as you can see, that one controls um, how, how bright it is and um, whether you want it fully on or you know higher intensity like this. This is at 100, this is at 50, and this is at zero and you can see it just turns off completely. So that's the BRR dial on the back and you just kind of turn it until you get to the setting. Next is a few SAT and CCT settings. So first is CCT. So this is set to 3200K. So as you rotate it, you can see that um, right now the light is getting brighter and this is set at 5600K. And you can see how it, it changes the, the warmth of that light. If you actually click and kind of press down on that button or the, the dial, you'll change the setting. And as you can see, I now changed uh, it over to hue. So you can rotate it and as you do that, you can see that these are in fact uh, multicolored uh, LED lights that you can control the color. Um, and again, you just kind of rotate it depending on the type of color that you want. So it goes up to 360, which is red. Um, and, and then you can see that it does cover a wider range of colors that you can use, which is pretty cool. Um, to get past that, you just hit it again and now you're at sat. So you can see that as I'm lowering it, it's changing the saturation of that color. Um, and now it's at 100%. Let me show you a different color so you can look at it fully. So now we're in red. And if I go back to sat, you can see that it's, it's basically getting 
changing the saturation of that color so it's not as intense. And again, you just turn the dial for that. And you just keep clicking it depending on what setting you want. So either CCT, again, for warmness, you can do hue for the type of color that you want. Like this is red, which is pretty cool. Or you can do it again for saturation. And again, you can also change, uh, you know, the, the intensity of that on the left side, which is that VRR dial. Um, and that's just a quick little, you know, tutorial slash class on how to use these studio lights. Um, so I hope you've enjoyed this 101 class. And if you have any questions or want to come in and, and use these uh, lights for yourself, uh, just come on by to Lama Public Media and be sure to check us out or just rent our equipment online. Um, hope to see you next time. Thanks.